Hi, it's Alex123656, and this is just going to be a video of my up charms, because in my last charm update, which was charm update number 18, um, the lighting wasn't that good, so you, all the details didn't pick up that well. So, yeah, let's get started. So, you guys have seen this before in another update, but this is the up house figurine. And so I then got an idea to also make the characters to go with it. So that's what I did. So here, let me move this back. So first I have Doug, which is the talking dog, which um, Russell and the older man meet on their journey. And he has his collar, which translates what he's saying and it flashes red when he talks so I incorporated that and then in the picture I used off of Google um, his tongue was out so I did that as well and he's all textured so yeah I then made the old man or the older man I guess and I made him as a little chibi and he has his high-waisted pants, his bow ties, belt, his jacket, and then in the movie, he had a cane, and at the bottom, they had tennis balls on them. It had tennis balls, so I did that. Then I made his big ears, and his big nose, and then to mix the gray for his hair, I used pearl clay instead of white. So, yeah. I then made Russell, the little boy scout, I guess. And, um, he has all his badges except for this indent one, which in a movie he had to get to help the elderly. And in the picture I was using, he had, um, pink cheeks, so I used pastels to do that. And then he has his backpack, and then with an eye pin, I just cut off the loop, and I put his little troop flag, which looks like that. And lastly, I made Kevin, which took a really long time to make, but he came out pretty nicely, and I had to make two of these because I made one for my friend, and I also made another Russell, which one was for another friend. So this is what Kevin looks like, and he fits in my hand like that. And so I dusted chalk pastel on his beak of orange and red. And then he has these little things that come out of his head. So I used, again, eye pins for that. Cut off the loops. And I textured him with a needle tool. And I had to mix a lot of these colors myself. But this dark blue is um, sparkly. And then dusted some of this purple here. And then some of the yellow. And so the sides look orangey. This is the back, then the top. And then this is how his feet are kind of um, positioned because he's lying down. And so there are his little claws, which have little nails and details. Then the bottom I made with sparkly blue clay. So thank you very much for watching this update. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and follow me on my Instagram. Bye!